you want to make this. But your AI prompts are giving you this. No bueno. So what separates a good AI video from a cinematic one? Camera movements. Two of the most powerful shots you can master are the tracking shot and the aerial drone shot. And today, I'm going to show you exactly how to prompt them in VO3. By the end of this video, you'll have the exact prompts to create buttery smooth character follows and breathtaking aerial views. I'm a drone. So first up, we have the tracking shot. This is where the camera follows a character from behind or in the front as they move through the world. It's what filmmakers use to make you feel like you're right there with the hero on their journey. Like you're together, like your best friends. <laughs> the key here is simplicity. You literally just have to ask for it. For this one, I said a continuous handheld shot from a wide angle lens, 18 millimeters, captures a first person view as we follow an electrician walking down a 1980s basement hallway with wood paneling on the walls. His full silhouette is ahead of us, inching along in fear of a dark corridor ahead. Horror. Cinematic. Panavision 35mm film. Next, the shot that makes everything feel way bigger and more epic. The drone shot. This gives you that bird's eye view and is perfect for establishing a location or showing the scale of the action. Again, the prompt is surprisingly simple. Key phrases, a continuous POV speeds through a photorealistic environment, twisting, rolling, and banking with violent precision. The camera rips past an erupting volcano, barely missing a volcanic eruption. The camera dives down into a lava-filled crevice, flying just above the lava before shooting straight up into the sky, revealing a beautiful sunset on a vast ocean. What if your prompt isn't working quite right? What if your tracking shot is wobbly or your drone is flying into a tree? Here's a pro tip. Use Gemini to troubleshoot. Don't just give up. Copy your prompt, paste it into Gemini, and ask, how can I improve this video prompt to get a smoother tracking shot? It can analyze your language and suggest better keywords, camera angles, or details you didn't think of. It's like having a co-writer who's an expert in the AI's brain. He's super smart. You don't want to trust that guy. Hey, Gemini, get over here. Give me your brain. So to recap, for tracking shots, use this. For epic aerials, use this. And if you get stuck, ask Gemini for help. These simple prompts are your ticket to creating professional, cinematic AI video. And most importantly, have fun with it. I don't know, throwing a demon and a monk fighting. <laughs>